it's quarter past ten on uh, Tuesday the 3rd of March and I just got in the post uh, February's uh, arcade block uh, kind of uh, dreading this one as I kind of have uh, made <laughs> apparent time after time uh, because this is primarily a uh, Legend of Zelda block this month uh, and I think after last month's kind of weariness and being genuinely kind of disappointed with last month's um, I don't know if I should be looking forward to this or, or not uh, and I apologise for the videos kind of suffering as a result because when there's not much I can say about stuff it kind of defies the point of me doing the unboxings and that's really why I started in the first place was I felt like I could talk about the stuff and this that and the other but we've had a lot of the same games uh, kind of merchandise over and over so uh, apparently there's going to be Pac-Man in this as well uh, but I guess we'll see so out with a knife and uh, this one's actually a bit battered on the corners uh, this month obviously took a bit of a tumble through the, uh, <laughs> through the courier service um, but, uh, fingers, please be good, please be good. Um, fingers crossed. Okay, well, there you go. Let's go for a t-shirt. Oh, no, we got another one of those fucking ball things. Uh, t-shirt first. Um, what we got? It's... Oh, I think it's Majora's, uh, Majora's Mask, uh, Zelda. I don't like this t-shirt. <laughs> I don't know what it looks like. I'm pretty sure it's Majora's Mask. I don't recognise it as anything else. Yeah, because that's the moon that falls. That's the face of the moon, so, yeah, that must be. It's a bit boring. If you're a huge Zelda fan, then, um... This is not as good as obviously the the first Zelda T-shirt that was in the, the, the in the first arcade block. If you're a uh, Zelda fan, then I can imagine this being amazing. But for me, not really bothered. Might see if I can uh, pass it on or something. Uh, but that's that. I don't know why I bother getting up because I always add it on top <laughs> on the video, edit it in. But sometimes I find. Uh, what I've done up against the camera is better than, like me, videoing separate, so uh, I guess it always works out in the end. Um, so that's, that's disappointing. Um, we have, oh, a Wind Waker, um, Link, plush. Not bad. I guess if I was going to get a Link plush, this would be it. Um, you're going to say it's not Wind Waker, aren't you? You're going to say it's fucking... Well, there's Phantom Hourglass on the... Uh, I haven't played Phantom Hourglass, so... I can't say, but looks like the uh, Wind Waker version. But he's even got a little shield on his back. That's really, really badly printed because it's not central on the padding. So, obviously, the printer... It's all skew with. That's hilarious. Oh my god. Look at this. I might have to, again, edit it separate. Look at that. It's not even on properly. That's hilarious. But, but that's a plushie. Not bad. Not as good as the Luigi one. But again, I guess if you're a Zelda fan, uh, a Link fan more specifically, then that's awesome. Again, like I said, not a bad plush. Uh, I might still put it up, just as a, to add to my collection. Not the worst item, definitely not. Uh, oh no, it's not a, one of those Zelda, it's a Sonic the Hedgehog ball. Uh, that's good. Suitable, oh, buildable figures, oh no. Oh no. Um, okay. Well, you know how much fun I had opening this, this, <laughs> this uh, last time. And again, air holes. It's not alive. You could 
totally use this as a Pokeball. I'm sorry. I'm easily distracted by shit like that. Um, yeah, you saw the problem I had last time. It might be worth coming back in 20 minutes or so. Um, oh my god, I'm using a sharp knife. And the plastic still doesn't rip. Oh, there you go. Ah, the plastic's not the problem. How do I open the bowl? This is not... These are not like Kinder Eggs where you can easily... <laughs> no, I am going to edit this bit out because seriously... <laughs> like I have Shadow Sonic. I like Sonic. I don't like where it's gone these days, but, uh, or not Shadow Sonic. No, it's the, the Shadow Sonic. I think it's like the, um, like the robot Sonic. I could be wrong. No, that's not the robot sign. Anyway, um, no clue which one it is. Um, I can tell you, it's not the robot Sonic, and it's not normal Sonic, and it's not gold Sonic. It's one with like a black, a uh, blue face and hands, and it's like fucking like Yeti Sonic. It's got like bul bulky arms and stuff. Um, and like bluish tips on its uh, on his uh, fur head. Um, clearly, this is from a game I haven't played. Um, uh, again, it's it's <laughs> it's that one. Uh, again, I'll, I'll build it up and uh, show it on the on the edit it in. But um, but yeah, that's it in the bag. I guess the fact that it's a Sonic item at all is quite cool. It'd be nice to get the other ones. The only very I would have liked a Knuckles, to be honest. I love Knuckles. Um, but they don't do the Tails in the collection, so... Um, uh, any of them would have been good. I would have preferred ones from, you know, a game that I knew. Uh, but I get the one that I don't know, so... That's my luck. <laughs> no, that's not a bad item, actually. Um, uh, again, a nice little figure. And I guess that's what I really like to get these for, is the figures that I can stand on my shelf. Or, you know, practical shit, that always helps. Um, do I mind when I got the uh, Tetris uh, <laughs> book last time, so I guess I can't say too much. Oh, we got a Pac-Man keychain. Not bad. Wow. With authentic Pac-Man sounds. Okay, you know we have to try this. Or not. Oh, that's a whole thing. It's got a tab thing in it, so I don't think... I'm... No. How do we get it to make shit sounds? It could just not work at all. Oh, hang on. There's a button. Oh, it does. Seriously. You have to hold the button in for it to keep making the sound. Now Mulder's going to want it because it makes a sound. Um, but I like that. That is a cool keychain. Um, no, it doesn't work again. Hang on. Yeah, that's it. That was its life cycle. <laughs> oh. There you go. It's a tiny button. That could get annoying. It's a tiny button at the bottom. Um, so, I can, can you imagine that going off in your uh, pocket if you had that? It's a quite good uh, big keychain. Uh, I like it. That's good. Yeah, that's quite good, actually. It's, uh, it's a good Pac-Man item. I like... 
What did we get last time that was pack now? I can't remember. Um, but I do like that. That's fun. Um, and now I've taken that thing out and now the batteries are very flat. But whatever, as long as it doesn't go off in my pocket. This is going to be a mug or something. And I bet you it's going to be fucking Zelda. Because we've only had two Zelda items so far. I don't know what that is in the bottom, so we'll get to that. Um, should probably leave this to last, but... So, yeah, you know it's going to be a mug. It's quite, like, square and... You're just waiting to see me cut myself. I can see it on this. Every time I use a knife, it's like, she can do Okay. This would better be a good Zelda mug. Seriously. <laughs> hey, yay! Okay, that's good. Um, and I actually have a story behind this. Uh, so, I forgot. There is a Star Fox item. Uh, and uh, the mug is Star Fox Coffee. Uh, I like that. And the reason why I have a story is because uh, I bought, uh, at a convention, I bought uh, a Stargate Coffee mug uh, for Donna. Because she loves her coffee when she has it. And uh, she's a huge Stargate fan. So, uh, but yeah, no, that's, I like that. That's kind of funny, Star Fox. I like that. I was kind of dubious about what the Star Fox item would be. I didn't really wasn't that bothered because I love Star Fox. So I think any item I would have been happy with. I mean, I would have been happy like with a you know Fox McCloud or or something um, figure. Uh, but I do like that. That's a nice little you know because these kind of mugs I wouldn't normally uh, buy myself. Uh, but you know for a freebie that's uh, quite cool. I like that. So, uh, so that's that. That was worth it. I like that. I'm not happy with this box actually so far. Um, maybe it's because I've gone in with uh, low expectations. But uh, um, what we got last? It's like a Legend of Zelda map on a. It feels weird. Yeah. A bit pervy actually. Um. I assume it's like a mouse mat because it's got like a, a rubber bottom and I can imagine using a mouse on that. It's quite flimsy uh, because it's been many years. I don't know. I think it's that way. I'm pretty sure it's that way. Um, trying to remember which way up the map goes. Um, I assume it's a mouse mat. Yeah, Hyrule mouse pad. And, uh, Genu yeah, so that's a mouse pad. Sorry, I didn't show you. Um, so, and that, uh, so, that. so, yeah, nice and. Uh, I wonder if that's washable because it's like that. I wouldn't try, but it's quite cool. I don't use a mouse pad at the moment. That might be worth. Uh, I do have an Exiles one, uh, but I'm kind of. Because uh, it's the thicker foam type, I've never got it out of the packaging. Uh, <laughs> so. Um, but this is one I can imagine, you know, getting mucky and stuff. So I'd have less of an issue, obviously, with that. Uh, we're getting this mucky than the uh, x -Files one. Um, uh, final thoughts. Genuinely, really happy. Um, certainly compared to last month's, uh, we've had much better items. A mug, a plush, the keychain, the buildable figure, uh, even the mouse pad is like so much better than stupid stickers and badges um i was so dis the t-shirt i'm disappointed with but you know what considering they were like oh you know zelda's going to be taking over the box and, and this and the other it's going to be you're going to have stuff from, from phantom hourglass and twilight princess and blah blah blah, blah my Jonah's mask and this and the other I was expecting every item to be they did say that there was going to be a pac-man and they did say there was going to be a star fox I certainly never would have guessed it would have been a Star Fox mug. 
I probably should have. Um, but I really thought it might be, I didn't expect a mug, but I would have thought it'd be a, like a Zelda one or something. Um, but every item, even the Zelda stuff, I mean, like I say, I do like the uh, Link plush. Uh, like I say, not the worst it could have been. Um, I'm actually genuinely, the only thing I'm actually disappointed with is the t-shirt. Uh, but like I say, if you're a Majora's Mask fan, then that's going to be right up your alley. But uh, genuinely, everything else, I'm happy with. Um, it's it, it's really weird, because this is the, maybe it's because I've gone in kind of dreading it. Um, it's not, I think everybody's got this impression that I hate uh, Legend of Zelda, and it's not that. I've not enjoyed the recent ones uh, at all. And like I say, I borrowed Twilight Princess off, I know I said this last time, but I borrowed Twilight Princess off Donna and I got bored after about an hour or so of trying. Um, and I played the originals, but I wasn't a huge fan. But I, you know, what the franchise has done for gaming, you know, regarding like the save states in the NES and, and etc. Um, I I completely appreciate Zelda, uh, the Legend of Zelda's. I keep saying just Zelda, um, and I don't want people thinking I'm com uh, confusing the fact that this is Link and Zelda is the princess, because um, that's not the case at all. Uh, although I will say, playing as Link on Super Smash Bros. It's rubbish. But apparently, playing as uh, your normal self against evil Link is the best option. But whatever. Anyway, um. No, genuinely though, I'm actually happy with this, and I know I keep saying this, uh, but I was kind of uh, dubious, the fact that they'd given this impression that it was going to be like this main theme. Uh, and <laughs> I think we've had more variety, um, which sounds really silly considering we've had, Star Fox is probably the only thing that's been, uh, that we haven't had an item from already. Uh, we had Sonic last month. Uh, I think we had Pac-Man the month before. I'm trying to remember what the fucking Pac-Man item was. Um, <laughs> that's going to annoy me. I'm going to go back and go, ah, that's so obvious. I can see it in my head. It was the pen in the first block. That just came to me. My SD card ran out of space, but I just wanted to do this little extra bit on the end just to sign off, really, and say, if you haven't already, if you get the chance, uh, and you think you're interested just by seeing what I got uh, today, uh, do sign up at uh, nerdblock.com uh, for the arcade block. Uh, next month has got two shirts, uh, two t-shirts. Um, so I'm wondering, uh, the picture they've got uh, advertising it is like Double Dragon. Uh, so it'd be interesting to see if they're Double Dragon related or, or something like that. Uh, that'd be pretty cool, because that would be a nice different franchise that we haven't seen in this uh, block yet. Uh, but no, I am happy, and uh, I'm looking forward to uh, next time. Thank you so much for watching, everybody, and for bearing with me. Uh, and uh, I look forward to seeing you sometime soon.